Hey guys, are you looking to find your happily ever after in Orlando? Well, today we are in the heart of Horizon West and we're touring this townhome behind me. It's three bedrooms, two and a half bathrooms, and it's a little bit over 1,600 square feet. By the way, my name is Carly, AKA the Enchanted Agent with Real Broker, and I'm your Central Florida Disney loving realtor. So let's go take a look at this beautiful home. During this tour, not only am I going to talk about this specific floor plan, but I'll give you some information about the community, the HOA, the surrounding area, and even the builder. So I will make sure to put chapters in this because I know your time is valuable. So if you're looking for specific information, you can go ahead and skip ahead. And I will also go over pricing for this home as well if you stay tuned. Before we continue on touring the rest of this home, let's talk about the location of this neighborhood for a minute. So first we're gonna cover the basics. We're a little bit under 10 minutes away from Walt Disney World Resort, which is amazing if you're a Disney fan. It's right down the street. You don't even have to get on the highway. Additionally, we're about 30 minutes to historic downtown Winter Garden, where my favorite brewery, Crooked Can is. It's also full of shops, boutiques, restaurants, everything you could possibly think of. And it's so beautiful. It literally looks like a Hallmark movie. If you want something a little bit more modern, we're about 10 minutes away from Flamingo Crossing, which is a brand new complex that has restaurants, it has shops, there's a Target, there's a Five Below. Pretty much anything you could possibly need is right down the street from here. Also, Orlando International Airport is about 40, min mile, 40 minutes away, and that's also the new Bright Line as well. So 40 minutes to that area. So let's go ahead and keep looking at this beautiful house. You'll notice that the first floor features a nice wide open floor plan and this great room opens up into the dining room and into this beautiful kitchen. I really like this style because it allows everyone to be together whether you're cooking or hanging out in the living room and watching TV. I will say the only downfall of this floor plan is there is no bedroom on the first floor and I know that is an item that some people are looking for so just be aware of that as we're touring this home. There are three different types of townhomes in this community and this is the end unit. So this one is a little bit bigger and more spacious. I will post the other two model home tours a little bit down the line. So make sure you subscribe to my channel if you wanna see those as well. One of the great things about this builder is they allow you to customize this home in their design center. That means you get to select some of the finishes such as flooring, cabinets, countertops, etc. But do keep in mind that obviously in the model home, they wanna make it look beautiful. So you're probably seeing a lot of upgrades that are going to cost you more money in the design center. Just something to keep in mind. Between this oversized kitchen island and the space for the dining table, there is plenty of space to gather if you're having a meal in this kitchen. All of the townhomes in this community feature a detached two-car garage and a private rear courtyard. If you're not sure what a detached garage is, you'll see in one second. Private courtyards are very spacious and they already come fenced in so you have that privacy if you wanted to put a grill out here have a family gathering I would love to see some string lights out there just to create a really cool atmosphere but this space is very versatile and it's a great place to hang out on a great warm summer day or even in the fall when the weather is just perfect And now we are going to step into the detached two-car garage to show you the space that is in there. Now, most people that live in these type of houses will park in the garage and they'll enter their home through the rear. A lot of people don't use the front door, believe it or not. But here's the garage. It is two-car and there is some attic space up there as well. So, you know, enough space to park a couple cars in the driveway behind as well. We are going to backtrack a little bit as we make it to the powder room on the first floor. But while we're doing that, let's get into the HOA. So this is an HOA community and I will go over what the HOA costs and also what it includes. 
For the townhomes in this community, the HOA fee is $197 a month. There is no CDD in this community. Included in the HOA fee is a community clubhouse and a pool. I absolutely love the Winter Garden Horizon West area that this home is located. It is also my home as well. I have lived here for several years and I never want to leave. There is truly an endless supply of entertainment, restaurants, and things to do at every turn and that's why I love it so much. You can also go to multiple restaurants or even special places that I can tell you about where you can watch Disney fireworks every night of the year if that's your thing. Now let's get back into talking about the house. This is the primary bedroom and it has an in-suite bathroom. This room is very spacious. You'll see it's a king size bed with two end tables. There's also room for a dresser and I like to turn around and give you the full perspective from another angle as well. So you can see that there is plenty of room in this bedroom. Next, we're checking out the closet, which is a full walk-in closet. Plenty of space for anything that you need in there. into the in-suite bathroom. We've got a dual vanity and we've got a full walk-in shower. While we continue to explore the rest of this house, I'm going to talk about a topic that I don't generally get into in these videos, and that's why it is crucial that you hire a realtor to represent you during a new construction home purchase. Now, you can purchase a new construction home without a realtor. When you walk into a sales office of any community, there is going to be a sales representative there that can help you through the entire purchase process. However, that sales representative is hired by the builder to represent the best interests of the builder. Also, the contracts for all of these new construction homes are written in very much favor of the builder. Hiring your own realtor ensures that you have someone that's looking out for your best interest during one of the biggest purchases of your life. And someone like me, half of my business for the last two years has been new construction homes. So I've seen it all, I've dealt with it all, and I can help you through any kind of weird circumstance that might occur during the build process. We could be working together from anywhere to two months to 15 months. Some of these homes take a really long time to build. Wouldn't you rather have someone like me fielding all of the questions and figuring out all of the stuff that's going wrong instead of you? That's one of the perks of hiring a realtor for your new construction home. Another perk is something that you're already seeing right now. I film and post two new home tours a week on my YouTube channel. So I'm going all over Central Florida and I'm learning all about these communities, the homes they build, I'm learning about the builders, and most importantly, I'm learning about the incentives that they are offering to buyers like yourself currently. So instead of having to scour the internet for hours trying to figure out exactly where you should move and the type of house you should build, just email me and I have all of the information at my hands for you already. I guess you could probably call me your new construction fairy godmother. You've waited long enough, so let's get into what this home is going to cost you to build. Keep in mind, I filmed this in November of 2023, so if you're watching this a little bit later, the prices might have changed. New construction prices change almost daily. Make sure you email me if you want updated pricing. At the time that I filmed this video, this particular floor plan is starting at $436,000. That might not include things like upgrades in the design center or any lot premium, so it could be more. Again, make sure to reach out and I will get you the most up-to-date pricing.
thank you so much for watching the tour of this gorgeous home. If you have any questions about any of these homes, or if you want to learn more about any other homes in Central Florida, whether they be new construction or resale, please reach out and let me help you find your happily ever after.